What's up guys? Welcome to the video. My name is David and today I'll be having uh, like a relaxed cheat day. Nothing crazy, but I want to enjoy myself and because I want to show you basically that if you screw up one day in your diet, uh, it doesn't mean anything, you know, as long as you uh, go back on track the next day so uh, that means uh, I will show you my weight today uh, also my physique and today and the day after and few following days so uh, you'll see I will not do anything crazy you know I will not punish myself because that's not what you do it it makes it even worse so we will just I will just have my cheat day today and tomorrow I will just stick to my regular diet you know I will go to the gym maybe do some extra cardio or something like 10 minutes more but I will not punish myself you know hours and hours on treadmill I will just go back on track and that's it so I'll show you uh, basically the whole process behind, you know, so that you know that if you just screw up, it's not the end of the world. So yeah, uh, that's it. I hope you guys will like it and yeah, without further ado, I think it's time to start this video. So. Hey guys, so the first meal of today's cheat day uh, will be as usual my favorite favorite meal with those cheat days uh, of course some eggs because I need to have something salty in the mornings so first eggs and of course two pieces of baguette this one is plain but uh, what will go in here some eggs and some ham and cheese and on this one I put as you can see like a spreadable oh, come on like a spreadable cheese and I'll also put eggs inside and see how it tastes never done that before so it'll be interesting of course some ketchup but that's that's something else, yeah, and I want to keep this video short, so I'll stop talking and just show you how it looks and etc. So, see ya in a few seconds.
Okay, this is it. I also put some ham in because why not? And yeah, this is my first meal. Uh, I trained legs, I did just 30 minutes of cardio, so nothing crazy like a normal normal day so now i'll enjoy this not bad not bad okay so you can see like that cheese is coming from the side very good Love this meal, as always. Now, I'll watch some video and enjoy this podcast. Second one with eggs, ham and cheese and ketchup of course, so basic. Yep. Classic, classic meal, I love it. Okay, breakfast over. It was very satisfying, not gonna lie. Uh, I'm craving something sweet. Actually, I don't know if I should get something. Not yet, not yet, maybe later. Uh, but yeah, plate is finished, as you can see. Yeah. And current time, so you believe me. It's 1 p.m. Friday, September 25. And yeah, that was my first meal. Uh, I will actually count calories for you. So calories will be on the screen somewhere. And I didn't weigh everything, so it will be an estimate of calories. But yeah, uh, you know some range so yeah uh, that's my first meal and i'll see you in the next clip hey <laughs> so it's been like 30 minutes or so and i was craving something sweet so i just prepared myself two ego waffles and yeah i put some fruit on top and just sugar-free syrup and that's it and also i wanted to try because i haven't had that in so so long uh, it's just a basic rice pudding <laughs> so it's, it's a weird thing but i saw that in the store and yeah i just i wanted that so uh, i'll have just few few spoons of that but yeah this is just two curb my sweet tooth after breakfast so yeah first I have to try this look at that oh boy I don't know if it's sweet or no but oh yeah oh that's so good Oh god. Wow, that's very good, very tasty. Oh, actually put this. Yeah. Now we're talking. 
That's that. Now we just enjoy these waffles. Waffles, waffles, waffles. Raspberry, blueberries, and syrup. We dip it in here. Very good. I think it is done. Now it's official. Final thing I ate for breakfast. I'm feeling satisfied. Yeah, I'm, I'm not full or anything. I'm just, and I ate a lot. I can eat a lot. But yeah, now I'm just completely, completely satisfied. So now I will just probably take a walk and just relax, you know, because this is a relax enjoyment day. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. I'm on my walk, uh, you know, getting some lunch, cranking up some steps and yeah, that's that's what I do now. Uh, the weather actually it's not so good. It looks like it's gonna rain anytime soon. So I better get going. Take a look. I think it's already raining over there. And yeah, not so pretty, but yeah. Now I'll just uh, go to a and w because i have never had their burger and yeah come back and show you how it looks so i'll see you in the next clip burger acquired i'll see you at home okay we are back home it's time for lunch so current time 3 p.m exactly uh, Friday 25th and yeah uh, first time having a W I didn't get the root beer though because I don't like root beer you know it's diet or regular I just don't like it I just don't like the taste of it so I just grabbed a burger teen burger and inside I will have just this little 28 gram bag of these Doritos never had them or try them that's instead of fries 140 calories for this tiny little package so yeah let's see how it looks okay yeah it looks decent so yeah now I will take it to my room and just enjoy. Uh, I'll see you there. Okay, so this is it. We've got some pickles, onions, burger, bacon, the cheese, tomato, lettuce, and a bun. So, uh, cheers. I haven't had fast food for a very, very long time, so. Let's see how it tastes. I will give you my honest review. Yeah, it's good. Nothing, nothing like wow, oh my god. No, uh, but yeah, for six bucks, good burger. Yeah, I'll give it a seven and a half out of ten. Yeah, like I said, nothing like crazy good, but it's definitely not bad. I'll enjoy this. Also, Doritos, first time trying those, so review again mm. 
Ja, der war gut, der war gut. Okay, so this, <laughs> this is my junk, junk lunch, <laughs> I would say. Yeah, so I'll enjoy that and also I got that ginger ale. That's actually very good, so cheers. Alrighty, second meal is done. It took me about six, seven minutes, five, five, seven minutes, yeah. So nothing, nothing exactly. It was a small burger, you know, it's just, but it was good. It was good, I, I liked it. So now it's time for just chill and maybe I'll go for a walk again uh, I have to pick up something and yeah so I guess I'll see you in the next clip bye bye hey on my second walk to get some groceries for dinner because I want to replicate some uh, something I used to have uh, very often in high school so I need some ingredients for that and yeah overall Weather is getting better and better every minute. Look at that, it's still cloudy, but that over there is so beautiful. So yeah, I'm heading to the store and I'll show you what I got. So see you back home. What's up guys, I'm back home and as you probably saw, you know what I'm having for my snack with my coffee. Uh, I'll take you through that. So I bought these uh, sugar cookies. I'm not gonna eat all of them. I will leave some of them for my roommate. And I made this protein uh, banana bread. I added some chocolate chips and I'm not gonna eat the whole thing because also I picked up uh, coffee from Tim Hortons and Tim Hortons means donuts so yeah I grabbed two donuts and a few Timbits so I, I wanted to try them and it's not a cheap day with a donut, right? So I'm not gonna have the whole uh, banana bread for now. So I think I'll just have half, just two sugar cookies, uh, just to try them. And then the donuts and Timbits, I'll show you that uh, back in my room. So yeah, this is, this is my favorite time of the day. Current time for 9 p.m. still Friday September 25th and I gotta get going because I have to be somewhere at 4.45 because we are gonna watch some hockey so yeah I'll just prepare this and see you in the next clip Perino. That's a lot of food. On the banana bread, I put some of this Cool Whip 95% fat-free whipped cream. And yeah, this is a lot of food. I got three Timbits. Well, I'll take it back to my room and give you the review. So I'll see you there. Okay, so let's get this started. This is a proper cheat meal. Man. This is a sugar overload. 
Well, except the banana bread, that's not sugary at all, just... Uh, by the way, the banana bread recipe uh, will be in the description below. I made a video about it, so yeah, I'll link that in the description. So, let's start with the sugar cookie. I just wanted to taste them because I never had them, I saw that in the store, you know, it has a ghost face, you know, Halloween, so let's see. Wow, not bad. They are, they are sugar cookies and they kind of dissolve in your mouth. Very good, very good. Coffee. So good. Now the banana bread. Oh. Yeah, this is proper. Wow. Protein banana bread and it tastes so good. Tastes like a real thing. I put, to be honest, I put more flour than usual. I put 60 grams instead of 30. And I made it from chocolate protein and also put some chocolate chips in. So uh, that's the only difference I, I made. But yeah, damn. Look at that, you can see chocolate chips, whipped cream, some sugar-free syrup. It's moist inside, so Good job, Dave. Good job. Hmm. Now just taste test of Timbit. Never had the Timbit before, so chocolate glazed. Looks like that. Nothing special. Okay. Honey dip. No, that one's not bad, but yeah, choc chocolate glazed, six, seven, six and a half out of ten, honey dip, seven, seven and a half, and lastly, birthday cake, that one's nice. Yeah, that one, eight, eight and a half, yeah, eight and a half out of ten, so, perfect. Now, vanilla dip, donut from Tim Hortons. Yeah, that one's good, look at that dough. Very good. Hmm. Yeah. And of course, my favorite Boston cream. Again, ruined, but doesn't matter. Yeah. Look at that cream. Classic. Okay. That's a test review. Uh, I'll eat this and then, yeah, I probably will get to start moving. So,
last bite look at that cream wow but that was quick i i'm a quit eater i'm a quit quick eater yeah well i'm quick everything ask my well <laughs> yeah so last bite of this delicious snack <laughs> Mm. Okay, that's it. I'll show you the calories again on the screen. And now I'm gonna head out to see a hockey game so i'll see you in the next clip bye bye hey so i just want to quickly show you what i got from the grocery store so i think i got this one up and these fully cooked breaded chicken strips because back in high school I used to have a baguette with chicken strips and pickles and mayo ketchup you know that was my thing my favorite thing so I wanted to replicate that so I got four of these pieces and they are lower calorie calorie pieces actually for two strips 120 calories, three and a half point fat, eight protein, 15 carbs, so not that bad actually. So yeah, I'm gonna have that. And by the way, I had a good time at at the pub. I had well four beers and three wings, I think. So yeah, I kind of feel it, but you know, this is enjoyment day, and I. I don't really care today, you know, so yeah, I'll just cook this and show you the final meal, so I'll see you next clip. Hey guys, so I'm back, but first thing before I make my uh, baguette, I wanna try, first time, trying hummus, I have a garlic flavor hummus, hummus, hummus. I don't know yeah I have a garlic flavor and I don't know I never had that so I will try that give you my review so okay I've got a piece of bread fresh new hummus let's open it okay I don't know what to expect so Let's see. Okay. All right. Uh, I mean, it's not bad, but it's nothing I would eat every day so I just wanted to try it but not my thing now I'll assembly the baguette okay guys look at that this is my dinner so we've got some I made the, the spread from Miracle Whip and ketchup so it's like mayo light mayo and ketchup then we've got uh, tomatoes over here I've got one chicken strip second some pickles cheese another strip lettuce and yeah on this side I've got another like mayo ketchup spread and that's my dinner, best sandwich ever.
probably i don't know i haven't tasted that yet but this was yeah i used to buy this baguette almost every day it was one of my favorites and yeah it's still sub is one of my favorite things so now uh, i will eat it and enjoy it also i'm having a rockstar zero calorie of course at 9 30 so i don't know i'll probably go to bed <laughs> around 2 a.m but yeah it's still friday uh, september 25th so yeah this is my dinner i'm getting pretty hungry so i'll just get started oh my god look at that i can even hold this thing like what the hell did i create look at I don't know. Let's see. It's good though. <laughs> oh lord. That's gonna be a messy one. Okay, very good. I'll enjoy this and and see you after. Look at that. It's messy. Oh yeah, very messy. It's so good. Alright, dinner done, it was very very good, but today is turning to be, I don't know, 10,000 calorie challenge, but nah, I feel fine, I don't feel full at all, but yeah, this was very good, calories again will be on the screen, I don't know how I'm gonna calculate that, but yeah i'm i'm satisfied and this was actually better than the a and w burger just to be clear okay because i made it myself and it was just better overall so yeah now um, i'm gonna chill i will go for one more walk my evening walk like always and then probably cook up my last meal so i'll see you in the next clip bye hey guys dave's checking in with my last meal before bed uh, it's currently 12.07 Saturday 26th of se September and yeah it's still like on the same day but it's after 12 so it's already 26th but it doesn't matter I have a, I have a last meal in front of me so I'll show you I have the second half of the protein banana bread I had earlier then i have a one caramel core rice cake with uh, like a tablespoon of the rice pudding uh, here i have two servings of greek yogurt with some 
cocoa powder, a uh, half a scoop of protein and some banana and crushed uh, one of these rice cakes on top and my favorite 60 calorie hot chocolate that's it that's how i will finish my day and yeah it was a good cheat day but yeah i think i think that's it so now i will just enjoy this meal and I so also I do have a bad soda here. Look at the banana bread. I put it into fridge and it's even better. Look at that consistency. I'll put just a little bit of this like whipped cream just like that a bit of syrup and I will enjoy Yeah, the banana bread is very, very tasty and with the, with the hot cocoa, it's so good for the amount of calories filling and just tastes amazing. So I highly suggest you try that recipe. Let's go for the dessert. Nothing special, just a Greek yogurt and protein and banana and that, that's it. Also, syrup of that on top. All right, guys, everything is done. This is done and I hate myself for just having such a big appetite. I just, I ate a lot of stuff today, actually. And I don't know how many calories I ate, but it will be on the screen, but I just, I feel fine. I just, I, I could eat more, but I won't obviously, but this is just, I don't know, <laughs> I hate myself for having such a big appetite, but yeah, that was for uh, this day, and I'll wait myself tomorrow, show my physique, and then following days after, and yeah also i'll i'll tell you 
what I did before and what I do after, what I suggest and and just something so that will be in the next clip but right now for me I think it's it's the end of the night uh, I will just chill and then go to bed so I'll see you guys tomorrow bye bye hey guys so let's summarize this cheat day so uh, the next day uh, after I had a cheat day I stepped on the scale and I weighed in at 170 pounds which means I gained six pounds uh, overnight and of course it's not body fat uh, it's just much of what I'll show you uh, the physique as you can see just I'm holding a lot of water so you know because 7000 calories is quite a lot and you know carbs and water retention everything is just uh, it's normal you know so I'm holding a lot of water and what did I do that day I went to the gym uh, and because you know I wanna just utilize the extra amount of energy so i went to the gym did some just a light workout usually on saturday it's just my light workout you know i train my uh, big parts abs and do uh, some cardio so what i did was just i train arms and shoulders and uh, did the up circuit and in terms of cardio i did 20, 20 minutes of stairmaster and that was it i i didn't do any extra hour of cardio nothing i just normal day uh, but generally you know <laughs> uh, i was in like 4000 calories surplus so it's basically i ate three days worth of food for me so i wasn't that hungry so uh, next day on saturday i didn't eat a lot you know i, I wasn't starving I, I just i wasn't hungry so i didn't eat a lot and yeah so that was my saturday then on sunday uh, i dropped to 165.8 Eight, which means I dropped four pounds it was as you can see you know on a physique just uh, a lot of uh, water retention just you know disappeared just so it's I look a bit leaner you know and yeah that's, that's the next day and it was also my rest day so what I did I just I ate normally, you know, I stick to my healthy diet, I ate normally and I did like I always do on my rest days, 15,000 steps, 15 to 20,000 steps, and that's it, I didn't starve myself, I didn't do like crazy cardio, nothing, I just normal day for me. And today, I'm recording this on Monday, it's third day, uh, actually post cheat day so I weighed in at 165.4 and that's 0.4 pounds lighter than yesterday and you know I I looked leaner again and tomorrow I think I'll be uh, below 165 so after three four days you will be just back uh, where you started you know if if you just mm, don't do this the other days just you know as long as you stick uh, to your dad and just back on track you know get back on track it will be it will be okay in three four days so yeah just i wanted to show you you know the whole process or you know you you don't have to stress about it just 
I knew that I was gonna do a cheat day, so before, the day before, uh, I just did 10 minute extra cardio and just, I don't know, I would say I decreased my calories by 200, you know, I just uh, ate little smaller portions, nothing, nothing extra, but you don't have to do it, you know, I just did it because I knew I was gonna uh, do this video so that's why I did it and you know the next day you are not you are not hungry so you just don't don't eat as much as on your normal day you know so yeah that's that's what I did and just you know nothing nothing crazy it's just you know one day of cheating uh, won't make you fat uh, same is <laughs> like one day of healthy eating and uh, like yeah one day of healthy eating won't make you skinny so that's just how it works you know uh, the important thing is the long term if you stick if you if you stick to your diet uh, long term and just <laughs> one day of just i don't know binging or just screwing up it it won't make a big difference so it might set you back uh, two two days but it's it's nothing crazy and i don't do this very often you know i do uh, during the week or you know months i just i eat healthy i train six times a day uh, six times a week so i just uh, you know, one day it won't make a big difference. And yeah, so that's it. I think I said enough. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you just took something from the video. And yeah, I think I will see you in the next one. So thank you guys for watching, subscribe to the channel and give it a like and see you in the next one, bye bye.